Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. It's Tippy. Today I wanted to create something inspired by the delicious mother's animal cookies. So I had these dinosaurs lying around for another project that I had in mind but just never got to it and I decided why not make some dinosaur mother's cookies decor. I thought it'd be super fun to do since it'd be very contrasty. Dinosaurs are really scary looking and be covered in delicious candy sprinkles so I just wanted to give it a go and I really like the way that they turned out so I'm gonna show you guys how we did it super simple DIY um, it's even really fun to do with little ones if you guys have brothers or sisters or nieces or nephews uh, but let's go ahead and go over the materials so you're going to need some dinosaurs and I actually ordered these from Amazon and they came in a really big pack so if you're not planning on doing a lot of them um, I would suggest maybe you know going to the dollar store and grabbing a couple you're also gonna need some acrylic paint so I'm going to be using white and pink you can also use red and you're also going to need a brush. I would recommend using a foam brush. It just covers a lot more and uh, is less streaky. You'll also be needing these super adorable little pom-poms. They are so miniature. You're also going to need glue and a skewer or toothpick or something to attach the glue. So the first thing that you're gonna do is you're gonna paint your dinosaurs. Uh, figure out which ones you want to be white and which ones you want to be pink and uh, the white one is easy you can just paint it out of the bottle but for the pink one all I've done is just added a little bit of white to some red and I'm adding in a little baby pink but you can really just mess around with it here try to get the bright pink that you really want to work with and make sure to mix it all together and then you're just gonna grab your foam brush and you're just going to paint your dinosaur you can wear gloves here. Make sure to put down something to protect your table or your surface. Um, but I went ahead and did a couple coats of this because you can still kind of see the dark colors underneath with just one coat, especially with the white since the pink. So once your dinosaur is completely painted and dry, you're now ready to begin gluing on the little pom-poms or sprinkles. And I am just using some tacky glue here and grabbing a wooden skewer and uh, placing the glue onto the dinosaur. Uh, make sure to kind of place them out sporadically. Uh, I'd recommend having a mother's cookie pulled up so that you can see how random the sprinkles look. Just kind of use that for inspiration. Also, I probably would have used smaller pom-poms, but I don't even know if those exist, really. Uh, you could alternate and use beads if you want to get you know something that is actually a little smaller so place pom-poms all over the dinosaur let this completely dry and that is all that it takes you're done you have some super delicious yummy mother's dinosaur cookie toys <laughs> I don't even know what to call these but I think they turned out super cute they look so colorful and just add the perfect touch of playfulness to any area and everyone who has seen them have just been so intrigued by them and they're like what are these it's just so fun and uh, it's a great conversation piece so um i hope you guys enjoy this and try it out yourself make a bunch of different variations i'd love to see what you guys create be sure to tweet me or tag me on instagram if you guys do and thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed bye